Let's have a look now at how these Solanum nigrum have progressed. Look, here they are. Let's have a look. Oh, oh they've got Smilax great. Oh, there they are, look. Solanum nigrum berries. I think they're Solanum nigrum. If you think otherwise, if you know which exactly which exact Solanum they are, tell me. But they're ripe now, or getting riper. Let's squeeze one away from the camera. Look. Full of seeds. Some sort of Solanaceae Solanums were eaten by the Aborigines in Australia. There's two types, I think, that grow as common weeds around New South Wales. One of them, I think, is it Solanum peruvianum that grows in North America too? Look up your weed lists in North America, the Federal Department of Agriculture, and they'll give you distribution maps of weeds with nice pictures and everything. Look, look at its seed. Well, there's quite a few here. I could, you know, I could collect quite a lot of these. And look, there's a little fruit fly going after one. Yes, look, they're everywhere. Just, look, just here they're everywhere. Getting ripe. What's it now? It's April. April in New South Wales, Australia. There's a whole lot of them. They look a bit thirsty, but it's going to rain today. That would freshen them up and make them all juicy and plump, wouldn't it? Mm, look at them. They're just everywhere. Yes, the Aborigines weren't stupid. Yes, the Ab Australian Aborigines aren't stupid. They had a huge uh, botanical, um, you know, collection in their brains, all stored in their minds by word of mouth. Look at these blackberries, uh, Solanum nigrum. In Sydney they grow around lamp posts. Make sure that you wash them because the dogs urinate on la over lamp posts. Read more about them in Wild Food in Australia by, is it by Crib? And uh, yes, plenty of good books. Oops, look at all that. It's just squirted seeds everywhere. So many of them. If you know what you're doing, you could never starve in the wild if you know what you're doing. Look at them, they're all a bit thirsty. But oh, they've put all the water in, because they're a bit thirsty, they've put all their water into their fruits, which is a good idea, isn't it? Look how plump they are. Lovely and plump looking. I haven't eaten them for years. I suppose I should uh, get my books out. I don't want to make any mistakes. I suppose I should get all my botany books out. Look at them, aren't they fantastic? Yes.